and welcome back to Half-Life 2, Episode 2, and we just ran into a roadblock and that is caved in, so that was a mistake. So we will promptly do a turn over here and go off-road once again, and we will be completing huh, over this there. I see over him where. Yeah? Huh, do you? I think that's white forest. Do you? Are you sure? Are you absolutely positive? Well, okay, then we'll go there. We'll go there. But anyways, I think I will be trying to complete this episode this time around. Um, video might be a little bit longer. I'm not too sure. Depends, I guess, how much uh, is left now. But let's go ahead and explore this area. It seems like we have to open up this gate somehow. Can we even go through there, though? Can we just drive around? Oh, um, am I stuck? Did I make a mistake? Have mistakes been made? Whoa, that is one giant crab Oh, it's dog. Oh. I'd help you, but I don't think there's much I can do. Probably useless, but I'm doing it anyways. Destroy it! Yeah! Oh, nicely done. Get clear. Uh oh. oh no. Uh oh. Are you okay? Doc, Doc, are you all right? Wake up, Doc. Please. Come on. <laughs> oh. You're all right. Nice. Nicely done. You had me worried there. Everything working all right? Good. Don't Go worry. We'll upgrade We're you fine. soon enough. Okay. Better now. We've been waiting for you. Just follow the stream, then head up the other side. White Forest is right there. You can't miss it. All right. Thanks. Okay. Let's go. All right. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Gordon. Get the car and we'll challenge Dog to a race. Thanks, Dog. Good boy. You're awesome. You getting in? Um, where, where are you going? Are you, are you getting in the vehicle or not? All right. Looks like we need your help again. There we go. Would you mind? Move that crab like creature. Awesome, thank you. Way to go, boy. You're okay, a gentleman dog. and a scholar, dog. Race you to the base. <laughs> Step on it, Gordon. All right, let's go. Is it up here? That was a mistake. Mistakes were made. Oh, dog overtook us. Don't worry, we got him over here. Got him on the inside. This is it. We made it. Beat him. Pedal to the metal. Let us in. Don't worry, dog. Let him through. Let him through. You did well. Thanks. We had a feeling you were close when we saw a dog take off like that. I was never so glad to see him, believe me. I want to well, get up there. White forest. We made it. Can I drive the car in Safe here? At last. Is that is that even possible? Maybe if I maybe if I go for a super head start. What what are you doing? Get, get out of the way. I'm trying to accelerate. All right. Come on. Let's go. Ouch. Okay. No. No. We're just going to leave the car here. Fair enough. Fair enough. You guys win. What? 
Where are you guys going? Alright, more loading. Loading for the win. So I guess we'll just have to wait and uh, finish. Finish the loading. Come on. Let's go. Finish. Finish. Alright, longest loading. Longest loading time ever. Or is the game frozen? I do not. Oh, there we go. A mutual thing. Dr. Freeman, you made it. Hey! Boy, are we glad to be here. Yeah, we heard you ran into a little trouble out there. The Combine's been trying to head in the front door. <laughs> I think they learned their lesson. You mind if we uh, keep dog patrolling out here? <laughs> Not at all. You heard him, dog. I'm gonna go see Dad. I'll catch up to you later. You take care of yourself. I don't think Eli knows you're here yet. He's in silo one access. So right through here. Shall we? What is dog fueled by? How long can he last on a single charge? Is he self-sustaining? Hmm. Is that in the lore? I have no clue. Is it this way? What was that? Was that I didn't touch it. It wasn't me. Dr. Magnuson. So, you ever used an AR2 before? Is this where I have to go? No, now an AR3, sure. I guess it's only the only path. Oh, hey! Gordon! Man, you made it! Yeah! Dad! Alex! I was so afraid I wouldn't Who are you? see you again. There, there, sweetheart. We're together now. That's all that matters. I'm just stand you on your say. head. <laughs> Standing on your head. Stay together, you can get through anything. Yeah? We make a pretty good team. <laughs> yeah, well, that's good because, well, now that the suppression feels down, we all have to do our part. Dad? Can you blame an old man for wanting grandkids? <laughs> <laughs> What's. What happened to you? Dad, it's not what it looks like. I'm fine. Are you sure? Shouldn't we have that looked at? Really? I'm fine. Uh, where's Dr. Kleiner? We should get this data to him right away. Uh, okay. Yes. Yes, we should. He'll be glad for a chance to get out of the silo. This way, Gordon. I'm here. Where he and Magnuson have been going at it. You think they were still competing for grant money? <laughs> <laughs> Something's never changed. <laughs> Do we have any idea how long until the super portal's active? We don't know for certain. We're keeping an eye on it. And what about the Combine? Will we be able to launch before they attack? It's gonna be close. All it would take is one strider to destroy our rocket. But we're ready for them. I'm sorry, we couldn't get here any sooner, Dad. Don't worry, sweetheart. We're gonna make it. I'm just so glad to have you back. <sighs> I'm glad to be back. <sighs> Hey, it's that head crab. Something's gonna happen. The HEV suit have taken excellent care of each other. <laughs> They're inseparable. The data people, the data. Can I jump down there? Finer, are you going to sync up the satellite? Uh, I'm not gonna or should it. I postpone the launch to make time for a family reunion? All right. all right, all right. I was just saying hello to Alex and Gordon. Oh, fine. No one grants me a moment's peace, but by all means, unroll the red carpet. Good grief. What a jerk. I only meant they might. I know, really. Oh, never mind him. Now, my dear, where is this data packet you've been carrying? If I delay a single moment, I'll never hear the end of it. You have my word on it. It's right here, Dr. Kleiner. We've got a ton of data. 
The strange thing is, it was all attached to a transmission from Judith. Transmission? From Judith? Do you mean the message didn't get through? We've got to see this right away. Just let me start the decoding process, and then we can view it in the auxiliary control room. For God's sake, hurry. Yes, yes, of course. Another alarm? Oh, what next in a parade of constant interruption? Hello, hello, is anyone there? Anyone? Uh, false alarms all day. Damn crows nesting in the trash. I do not know how I am supposed to concentrate with all of this racket. Freeman. Freeman, you're not doing anything. Make yourself useful and find out what the hell is going on in there. Uh, yes. Gordon, if you don't mind, I'd feel better if you had a look. Catch up with us when you're done. What? What? Don't leave me! No! I know something bad is gonna happen if you guys go. I don't want him! I don't want him! No! Well, what are you waiting for, Freeman? A hug? The situation's not going to investigate itself. Fine. I'm going. Don't have to bite my head off. Where's my magnum? Oh, no bullets. Darn. Is there any supplies? Nope. None? None whatsoever? Okay, fine. This is where I have to go. Do I have to press this button? I pressed it. Going down. I bet some. Attention personnel! This is Dr. Magnuson. Since the secondary silo staff seem incapable of solving their little crow problem, you will be happy to hear we have put the popular Dr. Freeman on the job. We all look forward to his remedy. And I look forward to hearing the staff's excuses for why they couldn't handle it themselves. Thank you for your patience. Okay. Ow, that hurt. Well, here's... Here's the problem right here. And then that's gonna allow us to go through here. Enough. Further authorization use. Further unauthorized use of the emergency override will be dealt with summarily. Dr. M. instructed me to admit you into the secondary silo. The secondary silo can be reached through here. Where? Right here? That? Over here? Through here? Oh, loading. I guess so. some boxes. Shotgun, eh? That's the ammo they're giving me, so that's what I'm gonna be using. Oh, I got some magnum shots as well. Whoa. Well, that was an unfortunate demise for that fellow.
die. There we go. Anyone else? Ah, a little slicing machines. Get out of here. I don't appreciate it. Oh, where's the thing? Eat it. How do you, how do you like that? Tastes good? Eat another one. Where you at? Where'd it go? Oh, it's gone? You dead already? grenades too. Ow. What? I fell. How do I get back up? Ow. Ow. What is that? Where is it from? I just want to get back up there. Stop shooting me. How do we get back up? Here? Was it through here? I forget. There we go. Excuse me. Excuse me. Gone through there, okay. There's a turret there. What's over here? Eat it! Shotgun has some distance in this game. Oh, I drew a little terrible. Got him. And I'm stuck. Give me that help. Give me that help. Oh, we'll grab the supplies here. Uh, we'll stick with a shotgun. ladder over here. Come on. Got him. Where you at? You're like stormtroopers. Can't shoot anything.
Calm down, I'm working on it. Wow, dude. No work. That's not working. Is anyone still alive in there? I'm working on it. Why are you so loud? Just let me concentrate. guys. This is Dr. Magnuson, and I am pleased to announce the secondary silo has been Where sealed. Are from? Back to work. Gordon, thank goodness you're okay. Yeah, I'm a boss. <laughs> Didn't you know? Glad that's over. We couldn't get in till you sealed off the silo when the blast doors opened up. Regrettably true. I better let my dad know you're all right. And do I get a kiss? You know what your dad said? Bow, bow, wow. Dad? Yes, Alex. Is everything okay? Is Gordon all right? Yes, he's fine. And thanks to him, the base is secure. Good, good. We're about to watch the transmission from Judas. We'll head right over. The Freeman must follow. Yes, I shall follow. Lead on. If you would take the Freeman from here, I can return to my place of honor at the side of the Magnus. Sure thing. Thanks for the help. Thank you for your assistance. I wish you good luck. Dr. Kleiner told me that Judith headed north in a helicopter right after they got here. But he wouldn't tell me why. Interesting. Again, thank you and good luck. Live long and prosper. Loading. Loading's gonna kill me. Gonna fall asleep while it loads. Falling asleep. Do 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 do. Come on. Boop. There we go. I'm fairly sure I Open it. Of the project. It's hard to say how much of it might have survived intact or whether there's I'm here. anything remaining that could compromise our work if it were discovered by the Combine. We'll need to take a close look at it, of course, but I should be able to give a better opinion within a few hours. If the site is where we think it is, then it should be no more than... I'm going to cut this short. We may have been spotted. Never have let her go. There was no stopping her. You lie. Wait a moment. There's something else here. It's the Borealis. Good God. Incredible. What? What? The Borealis? It's real? Oh, yes, quite real, despite its almost legendary stature. Our peers at Aperture Science were at work on a project of some promise, but in their rush to beat Black Mesa for funding, they must have compromised ordinary standards of risk. We heard their research vessel had simply disappeared, vanished, with all hands, and even part of the dry dock. Oh, yeah! Few believed the Borealis would ever be seen again. 
It should have been lost forever. Ah, but now that we've found it, we can use it against the Combine. Did you... Use it? That thing has to be destroyed. But think of the advantage for humanity. We can't simply waste all that potential. Did Black Mesa talk to you anything? There's no controlling that kind of power. Well, yes. There's always a risk, Eli. But my goodness, we have coordinates, blueprints, hailing frequencies. Quite ingenious of Dr. Mossman to hide it all in the carrier way. Well, that means she's still alive up there. But if the Combine catch her, they'll tear out everything she knows. There'll be nothing left of her. But we don't know for sure I won't that... take that chance. I'm going after Dad. her. Now, Eli, the only thing worse than Judith falling into their hands would be if they should get a hold of you. She may know the particulars of the Borealis, but you, you know everything about the Resistance. Listen to Dr. Kleiner, Dad. Gordon and I are more than able to handle this. We'll get her back. Kleiner, where are you? Why isn't the decoding finished? Oh, fine. The code. Yes, Magnuson, it just needs a little bit longer. If you're waiting for the Combines, go ahead. They'll soon be here to give it to you in person. I'll hurry it along, Magnuson. I'll be back. As soon as I finish. Yeah, they did have that Easter egg in uh, Dad, are you okay? Portal about that, okay. about the uh, dry dock. Completely place. forgot about that. Dad, I didn't know it would play a part here. Prepare for unforeseen consequences. What did you say? Dad! Okay. It's okay. Just, just lean into me. Let's get you off your feet. Thank you, baby. I'll be fine in a minute or two. Okay. Do you need anything? Actually, Alex, would you... Would you mind getting me a cup of tea? There's a hot plate in the old staff room. I'll be right back. Gordon, you keep an eye on him? We're, we're not going anywhere. Thank you, baby. Something's gonna happen while you go. I should follow. No, it won't let me. No! I know something's gonna happen. The last time I heard those words was back at Black Mesa. You had just stepped into the test chamber when he whispered them in my ear. You know who I'm talking about. Our mutual friend. When he brought in that crystal, I knew I... I should have aborted that damn test, but I didn't. The whole world went to hell that day. And now, now he's using my little girl, putting words in her mouth. God damn it. I should have known when he rescued her it was for his own damn reasons. Gordon, there's so much I need to tell you. Between us, we may finally have a chance. Um, Here you go. Whoa, where'd you come from? Is everything all right? There's nothing, honey. All right, people, change of plans. There is no way we can launch before those striders are... Oh, oh, excuse me if I'm interrupting tea time. I'll just step out until you've finished, if that's more convenient. All right. Well, Freeman, I believe I've found the perfect use for you. Follow me, quickly. Die. We'll, uh, we'll talk later. All right. I'll catch up with you in a bit. All right, just, ha just hang out, make sure he's fine. I'll take care of this ass right here. Bam! Right in the back of the head. Freeman, striders are coming. All right, you gonna give me rockets? One of those damn things could shoot down our rockets. Don't dare launch until all striders are destroyed. Now you've proved yourself capable, and the staff seem to respect you. Therefore, I'm putting defense of White Forest. Do not this erase. This ingenious new weapon of mine in your hands. Okay. We call it the so Magnuson apparently device. we take it from there. Gravity gun. Level, you understand? Pop but it, it on his head. To please the personnel. Now look lively in there. Warm up the delivery port. Whatever you say. Now what it is is a sort of sticky bomb, although cleverer than that makes it sound. From your point of view, you merely pitch the device at the Strider's hull, then blow it up. I've struggled with a mechanism for launching the device, but. Well, your zero-point energy field manipulator clears up that little problem. 
Now follow me, and we'll let you get in some practice while we still have time. Hello, I'm a doctor as well. Dr. Freeman, Don't ring a bell. Don't be alarmed, Freeman. This Strider's days of impaling your friends are a thing of the past. Now, out in the field, we'll supply you with all the Magnuson devices you need through delivery ports like this one. For the safety of the base, these devices are the opposite. They cannot explode like those you will find. That's right. And toss it at the mid. Good. Now, take out the firearm of your choice and shoot the device. There you go. Ah, not too difficult at this range, is it? Gets a bit harder when it's moving about and firing at you, of course. Now, let's move on to a more challenging task. Okay, Ryan, so... Send the target to the far end of the rail. You couldn't implement a self-detonating mechanism or a remote detonating mechanism. With your intelligence, that should have been fairly easy to do, no? Or is there some unforeseen consequences or some sort that prevents you from doing so? Well, that overshot. Hey, quiet. I don't see you doing any better. As you can see, the Magnusons are fragile. They will disintegrate immediately if they miss their target. Well then, maybe you should properly design this then. Magnificent device, isn't it? Not really. Right over here when you are ready to head up. So, are we good to go? Had enough? Your car is fueled and ready to go. Alright, let's go. Now, every building in the valley has its own dispenser port. So, you'll have ample supply of explosives. If you say so, I'm gonna take this now, just in case. I'm relying on you not to squander my trust. Or my magnificence. Oh, and Freeman! If you pull this off, I might just forgive you for that debacle at Black Mesa. You know the one I mean, involving a certain microwave casserole. Huh. Just give me a rocket launcher. Oh, look at that, baby. And of course, we load. I just I just want to pull out my crowbar and hit those supply crates, but no, it just has to load at this time. It can't load when I get in the car. No, just loads in the most exciting period of the game where you open crates, just like getting gifts, man. Doctor Freeman, over here. I'm gonna put this device. Taking a few the... liberties with your car. There we go. Check it out. I added a rack for Magnuson devices back here. Nice. Well, I put one in the uh, passenger seat anyways. I tweaked your onboard radar so the combines show up red on the dashboard unit now. Plus, it'll send a homing signal to your HEV suit in case you get separated from your car. No need to thank me. Well, I'm gonna thank now you anyways. You're a gentleman and a scholar. We're right here at the south end of the valley. Rest of the gang's up north by the old sawmill here. Head on up there, and they'll fill you in on the battle plan. I'll be staying here to watch the field and send status updates. Good luck out there. Thank you. What the? I don't want to grab this. There we go. Yeah. Aha. Ah, my baby is right there. Good, good. Hopefully it doesn't fall out while I'm driving. You'll find the sawmill at the far end of the valley. Of incursion. Keep alert. Am I going the right way? I have no clue if I'm going the right way. So 
they've sent Freeman, have they? Good man. We've counted a dozen striders just north of us. Our job is to keep them from reaching the base to the south. If they get close enough for one good shot at the silo, the whole launch is a bust. And in case striders aren't bad enough, recon indicates they're being escorted by packs of hunters. Great. Now, what I want you to do... Attention! Uh oh North perimeter three. We have a strider approaching from the crane. Defensive positions, go! Oh boy, here we go. Everyone ready? We need to stop him here. Remember, the strike will bring the picture down. Man, this is gonna be bad. Hey, stay focused. Where'd it go? Cover, start shooting. Three metal to the hard work. That rocket better work. Device dispensing machine. There's one here too, isn't there? Alright. I'm ready for you now. Where'd you go? Here? Is that where it was? There's the water tower. But where's the strider? Where are you, my friend? Oh, please don't be shy. Here you are, my beauty. Well, that didn't work now, did it? Alright, we'll wait until it gets closer. Actually, you know what we're gonna do? This is what we're gonna do. Get in. Direct assault. Hit this guy in the face. Oh, you like that? You like being hit by a car, buddy? Oh. Sorry, did that hurt? Hit him in the butt. There we go. Turn on my flashlight. Turn that off. You gotta take those hunters G. out first. Don't worry, I got a cover man. So where are these guys at? Over here? 
run him over and shoot the little ball. The, the bice. Magnus, the bice, or whatever. Whatever they're called. Ah, here they are. So, I'm just gonna run over this guy. Oh, got him. game freezes. Is it gonna unfreeze itself? Why it freeze? Why are you freezing game? Alright, I guess we're just gonna have to wait. I'll skip this uh, part. Oh, there we go. Keep up the good work. Only a few striders left. Where's the where is it? Oh, here it is. Grab them some flies. Another strider coming in towards what used to be the sawmill. All right, we got that. What? No, come back. There we go. So I guess we'll run over the dudes again, and then we'll tap him, tap him in the butt. A strider has been spotted by the crane. The traveling in packs. made itself upright. Uh-oh. Uh-oh's right. You're in my way. We'll keep this place stocked with help. Where are they? Time to run over more hunters. Run them down. Oh, did he die? Alright, fair enough. I, I was gonna say, did he blow the device up? Alright, let's just drive right under this guy. Get out of here. Tap him for the book. There we go. Is that it? Or is there more? Yo, you wanna right. jump in? Personal. Whoa, 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 he pushed my car. That's crazy, man. Watch out for the hunters! 
Let me just fill up the vehicle. There we go. Let's see. I don't see any... I don't see anything on the map. So let's head back. Where's home base? We good? Or do I have to do more? Oh. Another strider from the water tower. From the water tower. Come on. It. Out. Where'd them hunters at? What? No hunters this time? Come on, why is it freezing again? Is my hard drive dying? I hope not. I certainly hope not. That would be terrible like news. That was the last one. Yeah? Wait, Wait a, a minute. minute. Get ready. Get ready, everyone. We've spotted drop ships carrying even more striders. We have about a minute before they hit, so gear up. This is gonna get ugly before it's over. Uh, so where are they coming from? You wanna jump in? I'll protect you. You will be with that kind of attitude. We have a strider coming in from the crane. Now there's one at the sawmill. I'm going to the sawmill. I'm right there, actually. Another strider just running for the sawmill. 
get right under this guy. Wait. Stuck on his legs. Got him. Yeah! We did it! We held them off! Good work, everyone! What are you talking about? No one helped me. Yo, you want a ride? All personnel return to base hey, where'd you immediately. Go? Yo, I'll give you a ride, man. Come on. Get in. Get in. Fine. Fine. I'll just run you over then. Yep, yep. Hey. Yep, yep, yep. Gordon Freeman. Wow. Thanks, Freeman. Hail to the king. Wait, what? Wrong game? Her, 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 her. Wow, Gordon. You were amazing out there. Yeah, I know. Come on. I'm pretty amazed, balls. Oh, that was pretty intense. That was fun, actually. That was different. Usually, uh, they just give us a bunch of rockets and we just fire rockets but this was a good mix up I like that I wonder if there's gonna be another big fight or if this was the final fight if you will and uh, it's gonna end abruptly for episode final 3 stages. or Geometry. either half of 3 but Dr. Magnuson sure will be a time to stop it complete tracking beacon now there's another bit of cruft we can ignore support equipment power down Hold on a moment, Kleiner. Ah, Freeman. Well, I see the Magnuson device performed flawlessly. Yeah, because I, I was feel wielding it. I compelled to thank you personally for saving my rocket. So, um, thank you. <clears throat> well, that's enough chit chat. I've got a rocket to launch. Yo, man, you'd be cool if you wow. just calmed down a little, For dude. A there, I thought you were gonna get a hug. Yeah, I know, that would've been creepy. Yeah, I just want a hug from you, baby. Let's go to the control room. We can get a great view of the launch from there. Alright, cool. Well, here we are again. What? There are no well, backup sites? Fun, I found an old helicopter that I was able to get working. I've got it all packed up and ready to go. Never a dull moment, huh? No, certainly not. I'm seeing a payload anomaly of approximately eight and a half pounds. Well, that's within tolerance. Uh, certainly not worth scuttling. We're back. 
I bet this is the head crab. Hell of a job you did out there, son. Uh, let's not forget that with the Magnuson device, those striders practically destroy themselves. Yes. Well, I think perhaps Gordon had something to do with their success. I suggest we adjourn this meeting of the Mutual Admiration Society until after we have launched our rocket. Now, I believe we're ready to start the auto sequence. I believe Gordon should have the honor. You'll hear no objection from me. It's all yours, Gordon. No, I don't want to do it. It's, what the? A hula hoop girl? Is it bobble? Wish I made a bobble. Alright, let's press it. And the head crab messes everything up. goes off course no. right no, about we need to reach altitude and transmit the signal to right the clock is ticking we couldn't have cut it any closer if that was our intention it is going to work now. right it has to once the rocket is in range of the portal we'll be able to switch on the xenium resonator well let's get outside I'd like a better view of the fireworks there should be quite a show Regrettably, I can't come out with you. Magnuson and I will need to keep a close eye on the rocket's trajectory. Aren't you going to see us off? Just as soon as this is wrapped up. I wouldn't dream of letting you go without a proper goodbye. Okay, I'll hold you to that. You too, Dr. Magnuson. Indeed. We'll catch up with you in a moment, sweetheart. Gordon, hold up Oh, there you are. The more I think about that warning from our friend, the more I'm convinced it has to do with Borealis. Don't be deceived. That ship must never be used. You have got to destroy it, whatever the cost. Where are you two? You're gonna miss it. Be right there, Alex. Gordon, thanks for everything you've done. For Alex, for all of us. I couldn't be prouder if you were my own son. Now when you get back, we've got a lot to talk about. <laughs> I'll bet the Combine aren't too happy right now. You got that right, sweetheart. But we've got plenty to celebrate. I wish you didn't have to head off so soon. If only it weren't so critical. It's okay, Dad. We'll find Judith and bring her back. Dog? Hey, where are you? What a nut. Don't go too far. Hmm. I was certain something was gonna backfire. Well, there she is. Gassed up and ready to go. Remember to keep in constant contact. We have no idea what to expect. Don't worry, Dad. We'll be alright. I just wish all this didn't have to fall on you, Alex. Your mother would be so proud. Dad. Come on, Gordon. The chopper's waiting for us. Okay. Let us move forward and finish you this. Have everything you need? I think so. Dr. Kleiner gave us the Borealis coordinates. We'll keep the hailing frequency open on the chopper radio in case Judith tries to reach us again. Good idea. She could well make another attempt. 
Oh no. Dad! Gordon! Help! Ah. Oh, of course. And no weapons. Alex! Dad! Oh. Get away! Listen to me! Destroy that ship! Whatever it takes! Destroy it! Don't! Oh! Dad, look out! Good hit. No! Dad! Uh -oh. Dad! God damn it, let go of him! Oh, another one. So, why can't I unhost my oh weapon? My God. I love you, Dad. Close your eyes, honey. I love you, Dad. Oh, no. No. Oh, my God. No. No. Well, that's unfortunate. Gordon. No. That's it? That's where you end it? Seriously? Come on! There better be a number three soon. Well, that was a tease and a half right there. I thought we were actually going to the ship and check it out, but no! Just have to end it right there. I was, I was emotionally invested. I want to have further investigations. All right, Valve, please. We need Half-Life 3 or Half-Life 2 Episode 3 as soon as possible. Or you can make a third portal. I like Portal, that was a fun game. Or even, or even Left 4, uh, Left 4 Dead, Left 4 Dead 3. Although the second one wasn't as good as the first one, I, I really enjoyed the first one more than the second one. I'm not too sure. Maybe it was the cast. I mean, how can you beat Bill? But anyways. Special thanks to everyone at Alienware, ATI, Dell, and other places. I think I read Havoc somewhere around there, but that's it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed. Are we just going to go to the start, start screen? Or are they going to give a little sneak peek? That's it. I like these. I like the series. I want to figure out what happens next. And I just want to say thank you for joining me on this Let's Play. I hope you guys enjoyed. And of course, until next time, I will see you guys later.